Welcome back to another of the court documents with SafeMoon lawsuit. Okay, number three here. Defendants solicited the sales of SafeMoon tokens. A. SafeMoon solicits sales of SafeMoon tokens online. SafeMoon homepage, safemoon.com, promotes the sale of SafeMoon tokens. That page, which includes a video of a rocket ship taking off in the background, prominently displays a button that enables visitors to buy SafeMoon tokens, as well as another button that explains how to buy SafeMoon tokens. Clicking the How to Buy button leads to a buying guide, which outlines four steps for pursuing purchasing SafeMoon tokens. The first step is to create a wallet. The second step is to pur purchase BNB. The third step is to swap BNB for SafeMoon. The fourth and final step is to huddle. At that point, according to the guide, all that's left now is to huddle and see your balance grow from reflection. Oh, that was wrong here in the text. See it crash and burn. Okay. As explained by Binance Academy, huddle is a term commonly used by cryptocurrency investors that re re refuse uh, that refuse to sell their cryptocurrency regardless of the price increasing or decreasing. Beginning in March 2021, SafeMoon, through its Twitter page and other social media platforms, promoted itself and SafeMoon tokens. As a result of these promotions, as well as celebrity endorsements described further below, the volume of SafeMoon tokens traded on a daily basis exploded from approximately $150,000 on March 9 to over 250 million on May 19. Hmm, that was a lot. The tweets catalog between uh, the tweets catalog below are just a, uh, a sample of the many many tweets from SafeMoon and its executive promoting SafeMoon tokens and other SafeMoon products over that period and the month that followed. Indeed, in its short existence, the SafeMoon Twitter account has tweeted 1581 times. Wow, yeah, I think they have a bot. Um, or just paying someone to tweet shit. Yes, I said the shit word. Shit, 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 shit. Thank you very much. On March 1st, 2021, SafeMoon Twitter account tweeted for the first time. The tweet stated, Welcome to the show. Stick around for some amazing things. On March 6, 2021, SafeMoon Twitter account announced a flash giveaway of 100 billion SafeMoon tokens to five lucky winners who follow and like and tag three, three, oh, retweet two, RT and tag three friends. The tweet stated, grab a big bag of SafeMoon. We are just getting started now listed on PancakeSwap. I guess it's not that hard to get listed on PancakeSwap, right? Yeah. In the second half of March, as further discussed below, SafeMoon retweeted a number of endorsements from celebrities. During that same period, SafeMoon tweeted instructions on how to buy SafeMoon tokens, the amount of SafeMoon tokens that had been burned to date, and updates regarding the number of tweets users that were following SafeMoon's account, giving the long white paper reference to decreasing supply resulting in higher prices. SafeMoon's tweets regarding the amount of SafeMoon tokens burned were clearly intended to imply that the price of SafeMoon tokens would increase. On April 3rd, SafeMoon tweeted, oh yeah, this is too long to even, uh, 396 billion I think, yeah something, burnt. 
In response, Corona tweeted, New all-time high, check continual burns. Also check moon imminent. The acronym AT, okay, all-time high refers to all-time high price. The same day, Corona tweeted, amazing, almost a $1 billion market cap. The same day, SafeMoon tweeted, next week we put together our plan of action to list on Binance. Binance is the world's largest crypto asset exchange by trading volume. Hmm. On April 5th, SafeMoon announced via Twitter that SafeMoon tokens would be listed on BitMark a crypto asset exchange in response to that announcement corona tweeted it has been a bunch of long nights for the team but it's amazing to see the results that day corona also tweeted i'm giving the safe moon community 120 percent of my energy until we hit the moon and i'll never stop on april 14 SafeMoon's Twitter account posted a short video titled How to Hold Self. <sighs> Sorry, I just get tired when I read about SafeMoon. <coughs> so sleepy. Uh, how to Hold SafeMoon, which explained the process of buying SafeMoon tokens. Maybe swap SafeMoon tokens? Okay. The same day, the account stated that SafeMoon was the number one search cryptocurrency in the world within the last 30 days. Interesting. I wonder what the references are for that. Okay, on April 15, SafeMoon's Twitter, pay, Twitter account posted that there were then 400,000 holders. The following day, SafeMoon posted an image titled All SafeMoon Holders Right Now. The image included three charts, one titled Bull Market, one titled Bear Market, and the third titled Moon Market. The third chart included a vertical line indicated, indicating that the price was going straight up. That day, the account also posted a screenshot of a text exchange in which one person explains to another that with safe moon tokens, the longer you hold it, hold it the more you get rewarded hmm. on april 17 safemoon's twitter account posted an image titled why holding Re why holding rewards you the image was a graph indicating that tokenomics growth increases exponentially with holding time the same day safemoon's Twitter account announced that there were then 500,000 holders. On April 18, SafeMoon's Twitter account stated that SafeMoon was the number one search cryptocurrency or crypto in the world and indicated that less than 50 days in 400 trillion SafeMoon tokens had been burned. There were 500,000 token holders. There were 100,000 Twitter followers, and the market capitalization for SafeMoon tokens was 1.1 billion US dollars. Like a, a pee in the bar, pee in the ocean. Uh, by the end of that day, SafeMoon's Twitter account had 150,000 follow followers. SafeMoon's Twitter account also announced that day that there were two new exchange listings on the horizon. That there were a lot of exchanges reaching out to list SafeMoon and the SafeMoon would only make the right choices to benefit holders or uh, Corona's wallet. On April 19, SafeMoon's account tweeted, Are you a SafeMoon holder? The next day, SafeMoon tweeted a video indicating that there were 700,000 holders, 200,000 Twitter followers, that SafeMoon was the number one search crypto, and that it was trending on Twitter every day. Also on April 20, SafeMoon tweeted, Let's take a bull to the SafeMoon and posted a picture stating safe moon bull run and only a matter of time safe moon also tweeted that day dummy proof instructions for how to acquire safe moon and indicated that there were then 800 
thousand followers, but that training vol volumes was so high that Binance Smart Chain broke. <laughs> really? Do we believe that? I don't think anybody does. Okay. Um, on April 21st, SafeMoon tweeted that there were then 900,000 holders and 300,000 followers. SafeMoon also announced via Twitter that there were a, that there was a new listing indicating that SafeMoon tokens would be listed on MXC in response to a significant significant price decrease that day. SafeMoon tweeted that it wasn't a dip today. We went back to Earth for a bigger rocket and more passengers. Emojis omitted. Haynes Davis retweeted that message. By the end of the day, SafeMoon tweeted that there were 1 million SafeMoon token holders. SafeMoon also tweeted that day, Rome wasn't built in a day. SafeMoon was. <laughs> yeah. On April 22nd, in response to continuing price volatility, Vitriol tweeted, Hey SafeMoon, it's all part of the process. Sit back and relax. We're just gonna steal your money. Referencing a popular 1990s song. He then tweeted, We huddle, they hatting, patrolling, trying to catch me riding dirty. Dirty! The same day, SafeMoon tweeted, Who's holding? And in other words, hold on tight. SafeMoon also tweeted, We won't let any troll hater fud spreader on this ship. They're censoring the truth. That is what SafeMoon social media is. And that SafeMoon token had 50, was 52 days old. There were 1.1 million holders and 340,000 followers. That SafeMoon was trending five days in a row. That 410 trillion tokens had been burned, and that the market cap reached 5 billion US dollars. Huh. In addition, SafeMoon announced via Twitter the SafeMoon is listed on. CBG exchange fully tradable in 24 hours. SafeMoon retweeted the following tweet from Mr. Crypto. Once the market gets back to normal, guess what? SafeMoon will be the third exchange, will be on the third exchange that has the highest volume of trading per day. Of trading per day. Let that sink in for a minute. Now breed and let those diamond hands shine. Diamond hands refers to holding a volatile investment even when there's pressure to sell. <clears throat> On April 22nd, Crony tweeted, I think we're setting a record for speeds and longest times without sleep. And um, oh, is he sleeping in his car or trailer still? No. And the team and I have been working hard all night on a multitude of tasks. Crony re re revealed later that day that SafeMoon's team was working on getting SafeMoon tokens listing on CBG. Hmm, I thought he just said everything was done with CBG, right? Well, just another lie from the Crony joke. Yeah. Uh, let's see here, 91. On April 23rd, SafeMoon announced via Twitter that SafeMoon tokens would be listed on crypto asset exchanges, Gate.io, Hotbit, and Let's Exchange. As part of its announcement regarding Let's Exchange, SafeMoon retweeted, You can now trade SafeMoon for any coin listed by Let's Exchange, including Bitcoin and other well known crypto assets. That day, SafeMoon tweeted an old post from someone named Greg Schoen that stated, I wish I had kept my 1,700 Bitcoin, 0.06 US dollars, wait, 6 cents, yeah, instead of selling them at 30 cents. Now they're at 8 dollars. About, above that post, SafeMoon retweeted, wonder how many Gregs happened over the last 48 hours. I'm really getting 
a sore throat here. A safe moon, don't be Greg. Caroni indicated via Twitter on that day that he had been working all day to get safe moon tokens listed on let's exchange.io. Aren't we done soon? Okay, 28. Let's see. Oh, guys, this is really boring. Okay, if you want to hear me continue this later, I asked. Where are we now? Okay, it's 10 more pages. Can I do it? No. I'm too boring. This is just... No wait, we have to do it. Sorry. <sighs> mm -hmm. 27, 27, no. Reach 28. Actually... Here. So, this 92 we're gonna start it with, but I'm gonna do that in another video. So, until then, bye bye.